I'm going to be recording this look there and I'll shoot some close-ups and things like that later how are y'all doing I hope everyone has a wonderful new year and just wanted just felt like you know doing something festive for new years so this is what I came up with and I hope you like it and we're just gonna jump right into it okay so again this is the look here and I just have a little bit of concealer under there you know just to clean it up a little bit but like I said I'll just do all that at the towards the end of the video but first I am going to use my Urban Decay Primer Potion and I'm just going to put this all over the eye. Like so. And up to my brow bone. Okay. So next I am going to grab my uh, my blending brush. And this is the BH Cosmetics Large Blender. And I'm going to grab my, okay, see, whenever I record something, I'll never have nothing together. So we're going to make it work. We're going to, uh, I hate that. Don't you hate when you do stuff and then you can't find nothing? It's so can't be like right now. So cannot be life. Where is my stuff? I just had it. Oh boy. Here we go. Found it. I'm going to be looking down because my mirror is here. And I'm going to use, this is a new palette. And I have to do a haul video. So bear with me. The haul video is coming. This is the Black Skinny Eyeshadow Palette by La Rock Cosmetics. And it's just a cute little palette. And I'm going to use this color here as my transition color. And I'm going to put that all over my crease. And wait. See, forgot something that quick. First, I'm going to mute out some of this darkness on my eye with my uh, eye perfecting concealer brush by Eco, Eco Tools and I'm going to take this and get all this darkness this hereditary darkness off my lids so I hope everyone had a good Christmas and uh, you know looking forward to the new year I'm looking forward to it because my 2015 y'all It was rough, but I have some goals and things that I'm that I have set in place. Hope so, you know, so I can work on myself a little bit better. And I'm just gonna take the excess under here, just for now. Okay. So, and that was the concealer I use is NW50 by Mac and I'm gonna have everything used down in the description so next okay what I was going to do let's go back to this is take this my transition color from the rock palette that I have there's a little palette there and I'm going to just sweep this all over my eye uh, just to kind of set the concealer keep it from creasing as well as so my eyeshadows will kind of have a nice blend and 
And if y'all hear something in the background, that's my mom. She's in there getting her workout on. And I need to be in there with her. But that's a whole nother story. <laughs> okay. So just blending or just laying down the foundation. Okay, so once I've done that, then I'm going to go in with this color here. And this is a um, loose pigment called Kitchenless from MAC. It came in one of the holiday sets. I'm not sure what line this is. It's pretty old, but I got it from the CCO. I'm not sure if it's still available, but I'm sure you can find several dupes out there for it. And again, this is called Kitchenless. And it's just a very pretty iridescent pinkish color. And use that to do the blending as well. So we're going to blend. The key to any of these looks is to blend. Blend for your life. So we're blending, 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 and then I'm going to go back in with the fluffy brush and help prod up. And then I'm just going to blend, 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 blend. Okay, like so. I'm not going to add any more color to that because we want to put some glitter on. Okay, so... That's pretty darn good. Okay, so now the fun part. Okay, so the glitter that I'm going to be using is also part of the holiday set that I got from MAC from the CCO. This is called Pink. And it looks like that. Really pretty. Kind of like pinkish, rosy colorish. Okay, so now. I'm going to take my oval shadow brush from Crown Brushes. And I got this from Hot Look. I'll leave the link down below. And I'm going to, again, spray it with Fix Plus. Now, some people use lash glue or um, glitter glue. But I, I just use Fix Plus because, I mean, it has worked for me in the past. And if it ain't broke, don't fix it. So, I'm going to get my glitter put some more on here because I like to pack the glitter on okay because I told y'all I could be a little extra sometime okay so I'm gonna put some here and I'm going to just take the glitter onto my brush on both sides of my brush and I'm gonna pack it on my lid Pick up some more. Girl, I gotta re-wet my brush again. And then I'm gonna pick up some more of that. Glitter. And I'm just gonna put it all over. And don't worry about the fallout. We'll get that later. Just want to concentrate just on the first three fourths of my lid. Not where that. Not so much where that um, black and purple there, but just right here. Whoop. Hope y'all can see. Okay. Like so. Okay. Now to get some of that fallout from around the upper part. I'm just going back in with that blending brush and I'm just going to knock some of it off. Don't make it worse. Either way. 
but it's all like it's New Year's Eve, y'all. You can get away with glitter today. You can get away with it today. So even if it's up there in this part, it's okay. Because it's New Year's Eve. <laughs> so now, what I'm going to do is my eyeliner. And I'm going to use one of these double-ended brushes that came in the Urban Decay Electric Palette. You know, the pretty colorful palette. I'm going to use this end there. I'm not sure if you can see it. But that end there. And I'm going to use my favorite gel, gel eyeliner ever. It's my absolute favorite. It is the Tartiste by Tarte. It comes in two like this. The Bomb Dot. Calm, okay? The bomb. And take some of this on here. And we're gonna do the wing. Hopefully y'all can see. And again, if you mess up, don't worry. We can fix it. I'll wipe some of it off because some glitter got on it. And go back in with some more. I like to hold that out like so. I'm bring it up like that. And again, if you mess up, see I got a little bit right there. We gonna get that. It's nothing. It don't have to be perfect. Cause that's what they make. Uh, Remove it for. dark enough for you then you can leave your liner alone me being me it ain't dark enough <laughs> so I'm gonna go on with a liquid liner and this one's by Maybelline it's a master uh, duo eyeliner and like I said everything's gonna be in the link below as well I mean in the description box below so let me shake it up some more. Okay, so yeah. I'm just gonna go over what I did with the gel. Just to make a little bit more black. Like so. Okay. All right. So, the next thing that I'm going to do on camera is going to do my the silver that I have under there. 
which I might change that and if I do I'll let you know because uh, it's looking a little different so I'm going to um, add this silver there then I'm going to do my black eyeliner on my bottom waterline some mascara and then I'm gonna finish the face and then I'll be back to show you guys the finished look after I do this okay Okay, so like I said, I'm going to do my eyeliner, eyeliner, yeah, my eyeliner on my waterline, and then I'm going to do the mascara, complete the face, you know, put my foundations on, snatch the hot, put that highlight to snatch them cheekbones on. Yeah, I went to New York for a minute, for a minute, y'all. Don't do that. <laughs> Don't do that. And I'll be back with the finished look. Okay until a few minutes okay so I'm back with the finished look You know, like I said, everything will be listed down below in the description box. And I just hope that everyone has a successful, a prosperous, and an awesome new year. I plan to bring more videos to you guys um, next year for 2016. And just basically, you know, just want to go out here and live life and do everything that I want to do. Um, Again... I just want to say a happy new year to everyone and again this is butterfly keys signing out and as always we embrace all things curvy all things beautiful and we also want to encourage educate and motivate again the last day of 2015 and just I hope everyone just enjoys themselves and be happy because at the end of the day that's all that matters bye YouTube